Alright guys, so this is the third time I'm trying to record this video. This is a little bit more of a serious video that I want to um, kind of put out there. And it is kind of a personal video too. But I, I'm not going to go too crazy in the detail about um, personal stuff and all that. But I am going to just kind of um, put my thoughts on this out here. I want to let you guys know ahead of time um, at the beginning of this video. I am fine. But I've been going through something. And I kind of want to just put how I feel about it. And you know how I'm feeling right now out there. For people who might be going through something kind of similar. You know if you're feeling the same way I did. Hopefully this video helps you. So um without further ado just really quickly let me warn you sorry if i ramble just a little bit i'm going to try not to okay i'm going to try to keep this um quick and concise and you know hit the points run through them boom 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 um but pretty much i feel like over the past couple weeks or months it's been a it's been a roller coaster like that's what life is right that that's what everybody tells you at least all all the adults and stuff when you're growing up and i actually just recently turned 20 guys like this week so yeah um late happy birthday to me i guess but um yeah so you know you you get told that life isn't easy and life is bumpy and all that um but you know when you actually get there sometimes it can be just kind of hard to um make it through and really quickly i'm not talking about anything super serious here like that you guys need to be concerned about um i'm just talking about kind of being in this kind of slump i want to call it for like the past couple of months so i kind of just want to talk about this because here's the thing it's not like I've been sitting around doing nothing these past couple months, all right? I've been pulling some pretty um, crazy sips at work. Well, not crazy, crazy. Um, during my time off from school, I've been, you know, just doing a little bit extra. And I've been going to work while I was at school, too. So, yeah, I, and, you know, classes, call it, that's been going um, decent. So, I've been I've been doing stuff I've been doing things that you know are kind of pushing me towards my future but for those of you guys who don't know um, I am an artist I've I'm taking some classes and majoring in graphic design doing some animation um, I got mixed in there with that and I'm taking a writing certificate a professional writing certificate so yeah when it comes to what I want to do in the future, a lot of really creative stuff, that's just what really interests me, and that's what I feel like I want to do going forward. Especially now that I just turned 20, I feel like I really want to start, you know, I, I, I don't want to say get my life together, because obviously, you know, it takes time, it takes work, I don't want to set my expectations too high for this year, or, you know, up until I turn 21 or something, but however... I do kind of want to start to get on that path and start heading down that road to where I want to get in life. Um, and I feel like these past couple months, you know, leading up to me turning 20, I've kind of, I've kind, I've kind of, you know, been lacking. I've been kind of slacking a little bit even, I would say. Um, and when I say this, I, I'm not talking about being lazy, because I haven't been lazy these past couple months. Like I just said, I've been work. I've been working. I've been um, going to college and stuff. I've still been kind of pushing out YouTube videos slowly but surely. Um, but you know, there's a certain level of quality that I'm noticing dropping everything I do at, at work, school. Um, my artwork, my YouTube videos, there's just a certain quality drop that I've been noticing, and, you know, a certain quality drop, I've been, I, I, I don't know, I don't want to say in myself, but, you know, uh, in a lot of things I'm passionate about, um, and here, and here's the thing, me personally, I feel like I have 
gone to some good places, and I have done some good things these past couple months, I'm talking about me, you know, personally, not like actually going places, um, you know, I feel a lot more confident about myself than I ever have in my life, um, and you know, I'm pretty happy, I feel like things are heading in a good direction, so, you know, on that front, I'm good, but I've kind of, but that's really now that I'm kind of deciding that I'm ready to get out of this slump, and here's the thing, you know, these past couple months, when I have some extra free time, you know, I'm just, I'm lazy, or I'm going, I'm going to put it to you guys like this, I have this extra free time on my hands, I finally get a day off from work and school, and what do I do with it, I sleep, I might think about doing something productive, I, I eat foods that I probably shouldn't be eating, um, and I, like I said, I might think about doing something productive, but never really get around to it, or start it, and just don't finish it, um, and you know, when it comes to important stuff, I, I procrastinate, I'm not gonna lie to you guys, so, with that being said, I've kind of felt like this is a serious problem that's only been getting worse, and I feel like it's starting to have a really bad effect on a lot of stuff that I am passionate about that I want to make happen within my life. And let me just kind of um, talk about some of this and what I want to do going forward and kind of give you guys the um, mirror image of what I was doing these past couple of months and what I want to start doing. So... Um, Pretty much, let's start off with YouTube, because that's what we're on right now. So, with my YouTube channel, at the beginning of this year, I really wanted to, you know, blow my YouTube channel up. I haven't really done anything with it since. Like I said, and like I said, I have been busy. I've been doing work and school, and, you know, obviously, I can't blow it up too much. You know, that would be unrealistic to think that I can pour an insane amount of effort and time into YouTube right now at this point in my life but I definitely haven't been putting as much effort not even close to what I wanted or could into it and you know looking back I wish I had because there's been a lot of stuff I would love to share with you guys over the past couple months there's a well, let's see can I find a notebook hang on hang on guys there is literally a notebook right here filled of ideas I have for YouTube videos for um, stories and um, art concepts and different things that I want to do a notebook full and I'm, I'm gonna be real with you guys like I haven't really moved on any of these ideas and that kind of disappoint I, I feel kind of disappointed in myself because of that and you know I'm gonna start tonight don't worry tonight I am gonna start moving on some of these ideas I'm gonna start pushing forward, um, trying to see what I can make happen with some of this stuff, and see if I can get some of this stuff off the paper and actually on the ground moving, see if I can get some of these videos up, see if I can get some of this artwork I want done, done, see if I can get that um, next big thing for class done early, or if I can get, um, you know, a uh, another job interview or something like that, I'm going to be moving forward in life, I want, I'm ready to start climbing up that, that ladder and seeing how far I can go when it comes to success and reaching my goals. Um, so, yeah, that, that's one thing. Um, that was the YouTube thing. With the art thing, like, I, I'm not going to lie. Like, there was one point where I was creating amazing stuff. I mean, some of the best artwork I've ever done before. Just like... I'm not, I'm going to say about half a year ago now, some of the best art, artwork I've ever done I was working on, right, I've, did, ever since 2019 started, well, maybe not ever since, but a little bit after, I haven't really even been practicing my art every day like I used to, even when I was busy, like, even back when I was busy, when I was still working, when I was still, um, going to classes and stuff, I was still sketching all the time in between and out whenever I can, you can't ask any of my friends, I always had a little sketchbook or something with me, just, you know, 
sketching ideals down real quick or whatever, coming back and making them into something bigger and crazier later. Haven't been doing it these past couple of months. And, you know, that that really is not good for me. I, I, I really want to grow my artwork. I really want to do some amazing things with art um, when it comes to career coming up and for even YouTube and stuff. So, yeah, I need to really start getting back on that, you know, hitting that sketchbook up daily. I don't have, I'm not talking about doing anything insane or anything. I don't have to, like, draw these insanely good sketches every single day. But, you know, just sketching, even a little bit of scribble dabble or whatever is better than nothing when you're an artist. So, yeah, that's something I want to get back on and I want to kind of, um make the promise to myself right now that I'm going to start doing again because that's something I want, right? Um, But anyway, you know, there's that. Then there's school. Like, one thing with school. Now, college is expensive, guys. I'm pretty sure you guys already know that. Um, And my parents helped me a little bit with college, but for the most part, I'm paying for most of it myself, which is why I've been working, like, since before I even start college. Um, I've been working, saving up what I could, and, you know, I'm really trying to, um, make sure I can pay for college or that I'm not in, in an insane amount of debt by the time I'm done. I mean, don't get me wrong, it's going to be insane one way or another, but you know, trim off what I can now. And one thing, one thing I have not done enough of is scholarships. Scholarships, grants, I haven't applied for any really now that I think about it, and that that's dumb. I, I'm sorry. No matter how you cut it, there's no other way to call that. That is dumb, dumb, dumb and I am once again extremely disappointed in myself that I haven't found time to do that yeah it does take a little bit of time um you know when you're already doing all these different classes and stuff you're bouncing that off of work and everything but the fact that I haven't made any time or set any time aside to do that I am not happy about that looking back and I, I'm, I'm going to change that this week here so yeah, that, that that's something. If you guys go to college, if you're going to college and you're watching this, apply for scholarships. There, I, I know, I had this um one friend in one of my classes, and she was telling me that she she pretty much has her entire college paid for, um, already because she's just applied for so many scholarships she's a few grades ahead of me obviously um she's a little bit older than me she's like a senior or something so but yeah she she's good like she's like she doesn't owe that much she owes barely anything compared to um you know the price she would have if it wasn't for scholarships and stuff and that's just because she's been applying for them like crazy and you'll be surprised how many people don't you I'm, I'm telling you, I've heard, I've heard, um, teachers and guidance counselors and people, um, talk about scholarships. They're just sitting there waiting for somebody to come by and scoop them up. So, that's something I gotta do. Um, I gotta get on that, alright? Um, but anyway, anyway, <laughs> I feel like I'm starting to ramble just a little bit. You know, school... Scholar, I, the school, the scholarships, um, YouTube and the videos, um, all that's changing, the art, my artwork and stuff, you guys are finally going to try, I'm going to try to make sure you guys finally start seeing that, no, you guys are going to start seeing that, cause I'm going to get on it, I'm really going to start grinding for that coming up, and last but not least, my job, alright, here's a big one, I'm going to um, start a new video, because this, um, cameras getting ready to cut me off here so hang on a sec guys all right so my job and here's the thing I, I, I my job that I'm at now is good all right so I don't want to talk bad about it or anything and I, I hope nobody from my job finds this video but you know we're gonna do this anyway um but my job I haven't been satisfied with it for a while. It's not a bad job. It doesn't pay. It pays 
pretty good, I would say, for some for a college kid. You know, I'm making a decent amount of change every other week. But, you know, I'm not particularly satisfied with it. It's not on the path for what I want to do in life. And even then, you know, even with the field it's in, it's just not quite it, it, it's not it's not quite cutting it for me right now, you know. I'm just seeing better opportunities out there, even in the same field that I could be going for and chasing. And I, I just feel like I'm I'm giving these people my time and pretty much um you know um I guess technically your money, you know, because like I just said, I could be making more money other places doing the same job from what I've been seeing and stuff and you know these past couple weeks I've just I put the test I put it to the test all right you know a lot of people have been telling me your job is fine you might want to stick with them you might want um you you might want to stick around you know you're young um build some time up and stuff I've been with them almost a year now so just to test out I've start looking around and you know I've I put my um resume up on a couple job sites and stuff like that. Um, and you know I've just been talk. I I've gotten a couple messages from different employers and stuff. I've been talking to a few different employers and everything. I'm not talking about anything that could possibly be a scam. Like I I've talked to some you know legit companies. I've been there already and stuff like that. And everything done got interviewed for some of these. And I've gotten some pretty nice offers, you know, even with me being a college student and needing that extra time. So that just go, went, went to show me that, you know, you got you can't really stop and be satisfied with where you're at if you want to get to that next place. Because, I mean, you're never going to get way up here if you all of a sudden are happy right here and right here is not a bad spot or anything it, it, it really isn't but you know if you want more you want more so what are you gonna do um but anyway this video is getting ready to get kind of long so i'm getting ready to try to um end this here shortly but overall i feel i feel like i've done um some pretty good things this year i feel like um things have kind of been fighting me a little bit on some ends this year and stuff like that um you know i've like i said just motivation in general has been at an all-time low kind of these past couple months you know and i want to start putting more effort into everything and that's something i mean seriously that's why i'm making this video because i'm tired of you know not putting effort in and seeing the things like i said that i'm passionate about suffer because of it so if you are in this kind of similar space as i am if you're kind of in this similar spot where you're passionate about certain things or at least you used to be or you were and these pat and like for a while now you just kind of felt you just kind of feel like you aren't passing it anymore you aren't happy with where you're at in life get up and do something about it all right um you know i know it's not easy for everybody but there's got to be some way for you no matter who you are or where you're at you know find a way to make your life better don't wait a day longer life is too short for us not to chase what we want not to enjoy life for um what it is so with that being said this is kind of one of the more most serious videos i made one of the more serious videos that i've made so um with that being said thank you guys so much for listening if you've actually made this far i know this went on for 20 minutes which is actually kind of it I was expecting to hit 15 minutes, but we flew right past that, um, so 20 isn't too bad, um, but anyway, thank you guys so much for watching, if you enjoyed this video, if you want to see more videos like this, definitely hit that like button, like I said, videos are getting ready to start hitting back on this channel pretty hard, we've got some um, good stuff coming up, so yeah, just be excited, stay tuned for some more um content and all that and i will
be hitting you guys back up pretty soon. So with that being said, thank you guys once again for watching. Hope you enjoyed. Hit that like button and subscribe to this channel. It all helps. You know, hit the, even hit the dislike button. Even if you dis, dislike some of the stuff I said or for whatever reason. I feel like I wasn't saying anything too crazy. But, um, you know, even the dislike button helps um, in some way, shape, or form. Um, weird YouTube algorithm stuff. So, yeah, hit it. Let me know what you guys think. And thanks so much. Once again, this is the third time I said third or fourth. I can't remember. But thank you. All right. Just thank you guys for everything. And let's get this, guys. Let's get back into it. ZFR out.